Hey guys and welcome back to a brand new video here on the channel, so today we're going to be doing another Resident Evil 7 video guide. Today we're going to be showing you how to properly clear the happy birthday puzzle. So this is a puzzle quite late on in the game with a bit of a trick end into it and it's one that personally I really did like. So I'm going to be showing you the uh, way that it is intended to be completed. So the first thing we need to do is actually go up to Lucas's attic using the snake key and we're going to pick up this videotape in this uh, cupboard called happy birthday and we actually need to watch this first and play through it so this is where you need to complete the whole puzzle legitly i'll explain why i said that a bit later on so the first thing we're going to do in this puzzle is pick up the candle obviously and we want to go into the room with the birthday cake and this will kind of start the the puzzle it will turn on the lights slightly so you can see it a bit better so the first thing we're going to do is go over to this barrel just here and pick up the winding key so take note on the liquid that's coming out this is inflammable liquid this is going to play a key part in completing the the main puzzle once we're controlling ethan again so we take the key and this uh, liquid starts to come out and fills the room with it and this is inflammable well anyway uh so the next thing we're going to do is go over here and light the fire and this way we can light the candle again uh, with the candle lit we want to go to the far side of the building and uh, burn the rope away from this door and in this room with a whole load of balloons in it we're going to pick up this uninflated balloon uh, over here by this cupboard the next thing we want to do is take that balloon uh, to the gas uh, output just over here where this hole is in the wall and we want to inflate it this will then give us a pen so the next thing we're going to do is go over back to the start where we got the candle where this mannequin is and behind him there is going to be a toilet just go ahead and flush it and uh, we will get the um dirty telescope so this is probably the the part where most people got uh, stuck in this puzzle to clean the telescope all we have to do is use it while going into the room where the cake is and that way the water falling from the ceiling will uh, clean it for us so the use of this uh, newly clean telescope is going to be over here we're going to look at these tv screens with it and this is going to reveal the password to this uh, safe box over here in the room where the cake is and uh, we're going to get a straw dough out of here so what we want to do with the straw dough is take it over here to the fire again and we want to burn it and this is going to leave us with a dummy finger so now i've got all three items to activate this animatronic over here what we're going to do is place the winding key in his stomach we're going to put the finger on his uh, left hand and we're going to give him the pen and this is going to then give us the password we need uh, to open the uh, final door which is in the balloon room so we're going to go to the balloon room, put the password in, which is loser, and we're going to get the valve here. Go take the valve to the room with the cake in it, so that we turn off the water. So yeah, so just go ahead, go over to the fire, light the candle, and uh, light the cake. So the cake is going to explode, and uh, this is going to light the room up, since uh, that inflammable liquid came out of the barrel, and uh, we are going to die. But obviously we're not Ethan at the moment, we're Clancy, and... We should have learned our lesson about this puzzle for when we do get there with Ethan. So now we know that when we get there with Ethan, if we take the winding key out of the barrel, it's going to fill the room up with inflammable liquid and we're going to die as soon as we light the cake. So technically we have to do it without uh, taking the winding key and obviously that's impossible. So what we have to do is since we've watched the videotape and we know the final password, which is loser, we're going to go ignore everything, go straight to the balloon room, put the password in, which is loser and uh, that way we'll have the valve key for the water so we put that in deactivate the water uh, go over to the fire light the candle and put it in the birthday cake and that way uh, it will explode but it won't light the room on fire since we never did uh, take the winding key out of the out of the barrel so as soon as the cake explodes what we want to do is go over to this hole in the wall and uh, rip this piece of wood off and grab the bomb and throw it through and yeah that is how we clear the happy birthday puzzle in resident evil 7 so yeah guys hopefully this was helpful if it was please go like and subscribe remember you can follow me on twitter you can support the channel more directly on patreon it's much appreciated we'll see you next time guys